Okay. I streamlined the turret while you were gone, introducing the Mark III. Ta-da! So I got rid of all the parts that fell off and just kept the stuff that worked. I mean, it was totally over-engineered, so it just does one thing now. It shoots. It didn't need a satellite dish. That was just dumb. Here, try it on these appliances I found. They were just lying around in the housewares research department in, in a locked room. Okay, nice. Done. It's just like the Mark One. Left trigger opens the wings. Right stick. I like that tattoo on your neck. Did you do it yourself? It's like a, is it a dragon holding a knife? It's nice. The more I look at the tattoo, the more I'm thinking we should both have it. Because then we'd be tattoo bros. Anybody would be able to look at us and know we are friends. You think you give me the same tattoo? Would that be weird? It would be weird having the same exact one. Yeah, ja, doch, irgendwie right. schon. I'll, I'll, I'll think of it. What about like a robot arm coming out of the side of my head and it's holding a wrench? So you got the dragon and the knife. And mine's similar, but more robot themed. Man, that'd be so cool. Oh, speaking of being cool, I've got something even better to show you. Gyroscopic controls. It's real easy. Just pick up the desk, tilt it around to aim, and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. And you shoot with the right trigger like normal. Go on, try it. That. Okay, glaub. How much did the tattoo hurt? When you gave it to yourself, did you Good. have the proper tools? I would bet not actually. Now Können wir jetzt leider nicht machen. Das spielt eigentlich für das Steam Deck optimiert ist. Another tattoo idea I just had instead of a robot hand coming out holding a wrench. What if it was like a skeleton? You know, so you're looking at it like, what's he trying to say? Is he human on the inside or does he have like a skeleton trapped in him? You know what? A skeleton on tattoo. I decided that's the one I want. So when we get a free minute, I'll find a pen and we can heat up that light. All right, everything checks out. This thing is perfect. I think we're good to go here. So, I was saving the best for last. While you were in jail, I got us a meeting to show our turret to Cave Johnson. That's right, the owner of the company. No pressure, but if he likes this, he's going to make us rich forever. Mm, Are you fun. ready? Let's go. Natürlich. What the fuck? Ja, nice. Die haben sich auch ein bisschen weiterentwickelt. What are you gonna do with your share of the money? Hmm, I know what I'm gonna do is pay off the money I borrowed to make this turret. Like immediately pay it off. Or I'll, I mean, whew, I'll be in some real trouble. Plus the VIG, I'll have to pay that too. <sighs> Does it make sense to you that the VIG is more than what I borrowed in the first place? It doesn't seem like it's, it's weird. Somebody overrode the controls. Hold on. Oh no. Huh. That's one of the appliances I stole from housewares. Oh, geez, it's got a gun. What the Damn. fuck? Man, he got that turret good, huh? Good thing I brought a couple of spares. I knew it! It's the housewares department. How did they find out about our tour? They stole our idea and now they're gonna kill us with it. Mm, see, they cool out. Swears, man. We're never gonna stop ambushing us. I mean, it's not really an ambush anymore. We know they're coming, but I don't think they're gonna stop coming though. We need to think of something else. I really 
think they're gonna keep coming for, like, basically forever. What the hell? Housewares, man. Can you believe it? What's going on here? Such pieces of... What did we ever even do to them? Wie so ein Elchkopf. Nice work. I got the elevator Junge. working again, but we have another 80 floors before we get to cave. We're not going to survive 80 ambushes in a row. Your desk should have some buttons on the underside of it. Those fire the rockets that got built into the desk. They put those on there standard now for safety reasons. So automatic death runs are engaged. Here we go. We are going to launch in 10, 9, was passiert hier bitte? Was ist das für eine durchgeknallte? Fabrik. Holy shit. Jetzt sollte man den Typen eigentlich kennen. Okay, really nice work. Good shooting. I think we're good from here. They probably gave up. I have given up by now. Okay, let's go show this thing to Cave. Natürlich. Also, I do have one quick confession. I didn't actually get an appointment with Cave Johnson. I lied about that. But it turns out, I didn't know this, it turns out nobody's seen him in years. I did know it when I lied to you about our appointment, but it was still pretty new information. Anyway, I'm not gonna lie to you anymore. I think he might be a millionaire recluse now. So, be ready for that. There might be a lot of jars. Hello, Mr. Johnson? Let's just go in. Mr. Johnson, are you here? Scheint wohl nicht der Fall zu sein. Hey there, it's me. Cave Johnson. No, no, not behind the giant head. I am the giant head. <laughs> I'm gonna level with you. A few years back, I got real sick. Body riddled with disease. I was a goner. Threw every dollar I had at it. Told those eggheads, hey, eggheads, make me live forever. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers on earth a blank check to make you immortal, and this is what they came up with? A giant head? <laughs> Off by a mile. No, they figured out how to put my consciousness in a computer. That's what's in the giant head. Their first plan was to put me in a regular brain-sized computer. Then they'd put that in a robot body, and hey, presto. Well, turns out you can't fit an entire human mind in a computer that small. All I could do was tell time and know what my name was. So they kept making it bigger, big enough to cram every last bit of me into this thing. What happened to my robot body? Still under the head, somewhere, all crushed up. Couldn't support the weight. So the lab boys put me in the big head, switched me on, and, uh, I don't know, I panicked. Killed a few of them. Said I'd kill more if they ever came back. Honestly, I, I regret that now. Anyway, that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Get their butts up here and end my suffering. Now, don't worry about me. It's been a full life, but... We're done here. I'm itching for the next step. Heck, I'm excited about it. Don't even think of it as killing me. You're breaking me out of prison. I'm just data now. I need you to crack this big clay head open so I can spill out into the universe. So, what do you two eggheads got? Uh, you, uh, you are in luck. We actually came up here to show you our new invention. Good stuff. Let's see it. Show them, partner. Well, I'm waiting. I get it. It feels weird to shoot at the boss, but it's what he wants. 
showing me something or what? Is it your tough looking sidekick with the neck tattoo and prison muscles? <laughs> I don't know if you're having like a moral crisis, but look, yes, he is our boss, which typically we wouldn't shoot him, but he's. Whoa, that'll work. I'll be honest, I thought you were two lunatics who dragged a toilet up here, but you are geniuses. He called us geniuses. We need to find his weak spot. Son, this thing's made of clay. It's all weak spot. Hmm. Was mache ich hier Keep bitte? Going. Holy shit! Oh no! What? You are made of metal, sir. So shoot the metal. Is it working? In the head, I can't see. It's working great, sir. It doesn't feel like it's working, but there we go. It's functioning nicht. Hey, you see that? I think that's his power source. <laughs> wow. Up, oh, here we go. Powering down the great beyond. Boy, I'll, I'll give you two credit. That is one hell of an invention. You did it. You figured out how to end my suffering. All right. Suffering ended in three, two. Ah. Backup power activated. No. Uh, you're both fired. <laughs> I'm gonna need your key cards. Just lay them down in front of the head. Not too close to the chin or I won't be able to see them. Uh oh. Bye bye. Ich glaube, das war's wohl. Was passiert da vorne? You know what? It just occurred to me that the only person who knows Cave Johnson asked us to kill him is now dead. Mm. Yeah. Do you know what the punishment for murder is? They told us in parole officer school, you're not gonna like this. Uh, it's life. Your whole life in prison. We should. Yeah, we, we, we should leave. Yeah. Don't touch anything. Einfach gehen, genau. And bring the desk. Ja, oh, okay, gut. Oh nee, die Arme. Sieht gut aus hier. Monate später. Morning, Charlie. It's me, Gary. Gary, your boss. Keep inspecting those toilets. Good work, good stuff. Good. Hey, it's just me, Grady. Yeah, just like yesterday. Man, this witness protection program is great. I don't know why we didn't turn state's evidence against those loan sharks in the first place. We don't have to pay any of the money back. We got cool new names. I like yours a lot, by the way. You know, come to think of it, you think they'd move us to another state or give us new jobs or something. Feels like everything is exactly the same, except mm. our first names. Ah, you know what? They know what they're doing. Anyway, see you tomorrow, Charlie. <laughs> what? Oh, man. Ape side.
Was passiert hier bitte? Leute, das Spiel ist so abgedreht. <lacht> Gut, das war's dann offensichtlich schon. <lacht> Mit Aperture Desktop. <lacht> What the fuck? Wirklich so viele Leute. <lacht> Kev Johnson, J.K. Simmons. <lacht> What the fuck? Gut, ähm. Ich lasse euch das jetzt noch ein bisschen bestaunen. Lecker Kuchen. <lacht> Gut. Dann war's das schon mit Abo zu Desk Job. Ganz normaler Arbeitstag. Wie immer. Wie jeder Tag. Ähm, crazy stuff. Wie gesagt, das Spiel wurde eigentlich für das Steam Deck entwickelt, deshalb konnte ich jetzt nicht das mit dem Gyroskop Zeugs da machen, weil ich bloß nicht den Controller hatte. Aber gut, interessantes, lustiges und durchgeknalltes Spiel, was gerade mal eine halbe Stunde ging. Daher, nice. Ähm, vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und wir sehen uns beim nächsten Mal wieder bei einem anderen Spiel, Let's Play, auf meinem Kanal. Vielen Dank und bis dahin, haut rein. Tschüss.